Hello everyone, welcome back to another installation video and today we have this Silverado 1500 custom and we're going to install the tail light tints on this Silverado. This is how the tail light looks before the installation and this is how the tail light will look after you install the tints on the tail lights. Light will still shine through as well as provide protection from yellowing over time and any small rock chips that may hit the tail light. And if you like how the product looks, link for the product will be in the description below. But with that being said, let's get started with the installation video. So before starting the installation, we want to make sure we clean the tail light. So just apply your slip solution to clean all around the tail light. So with this one, it does come with multiple pieces due to the fact that the tail light does have a deep curvature on the top and on the bottom of the tail light. So with this one, we're going to start off with installing the pieces starting from the bottom and work our way to the top. And then once we're done installing this side, we will install the front side and then finish it off with the edge right here. So let's get started. So when you receive the tents, this would be the piece for the driver's side. So it's just going to be laid out for you according to how the installation would be. So the bottom piece will be for this part and then so forth. And then this piece here will be for the edge here. So we want to start with this half first right here. So apply your slip solution to align it. And with this one, you are going to notice that the tail light does have a two-tone red color. So you want to align the edge of the, the tint to where the two-tone is about to start changing color. Roughly around there, so as to align to where it's about to change. This piece right here is going to get covered by the other piece of the tent, so it has to be aligned right there. Once you have it there, you are going to notice the film does overlap on this end. This part, we're just going to overlap it to the front side. So first, we're going to tack all of this down, and then once we're done, continue on with the rest. So apply your tack solution, and then start tacking everything down. Once you have most of it tacked down, the next thing is applying heat around the edges. That way, we could remove the small fingers that you see on the edge. So just apply tack solution, heat, and then with your microfiber towel, just close the fingers. Okay, and once we finish tacking down the whole edge, make sure before you move on to the next step, you want to double check and see if any of the film is lifting. But if you see that everything tacked down and there's no film lifting, then we can go ahead and proceed with the next step, which would be this piece right here. So this piece is going to be the same. We're going to apply slip solution and align it right to where the color is about to change of the tail light. So just apply slip solution. And the same steps we did with this one, we're going to do right here. Once you have it aligned, the next thing is tacking it down. So just apply your tack solution and then with one hand, hold it in place and with the other, just squeegee lightly. That way the film starts tacking down little by little and then just switch and tack down the other side. Do it lightly as well. Once you did your first light squeegee and you see that the film isn't moving, now you could squeegee down with more pressure on the film to remove any of the excess solution that's on the back of the film. Okay, and when, once we're done tagging it down, the last step is just to seal the edges around. So we're just going to use tack solution, heat, and then with your microfiber towel, and that will seal the edge all around. Just make sure before you move on with the next piece to check the edges, make sure none of them is lifting. Once you confirm that the tint isn't lifting, the next step is just moving on to this piece right here. It's just the same steps until you finish up to here the top piece. So the same process that we did with these two, we're going to do it here again. So apply your slip solution and it's just aligning it right on the edge right here where the color is about to change. Once we have it aligned, the next thing is tacking it down with tack solution. So we're going to spray tack solution and then from here you can use your finger to tack it down. And then once we have this, this piece tacked down and it's not going to move, we could tack down the rest with our finger. So it's just going like this, just so it sits in place. Once we have it tacked down, spray tack solution one more time. We could squeegee, that way we could remove all of the solution that's in the back. And then just make sure you're holding it and squeegee. Okay, now it's done. Just to seal all the edges around, same process. Tack solution, heat, and then microfiber towel. Like the same steps we did with the rest, we're gonna do with the last two pieces. So just apply your slip solution and just align it right on the edge here. And it's gonna curve here. So once you have it aligned, tack it down, hold it and then tack it down in one side and then continue with the rest. Okay. 
And now we seal it with tack and with heat and with your microfiber towel. Okay, and now we move on to this piece. Slip solution on both the towel light and on the tent and then just align it. So make sure it's aligned here and it's gonna go on top here. Once you have it aligned, start tagging it down again. Once we have most of the film tagged down, we're just gonna apply tag solution and then heat. That way we're able to help the film curve to this part of the curve of the tail light. Once we're done sealing the tint that we just applied and we make sure there's no film that's peeling off, we can move on with this installing the front piece here. Okay, to start off this installation, we will need to apply slip solution to the film and to the tail light to align it to the top edge of the tail light. Once we have it aligned to the top edge, we need to make sure to align it to the edge all around. So as you're aligning the tent going down, make sure everything's aligned. You are going to have excess material on the side. That excess material is used to cover the edges on the other side of the tail light. Now that we have the tent in position, the next step is tacking down the front piece of the tail light. So you want to apply tack solution on the front, start squeegeeing from the top and make your way to the bottom of the tail light. Once we finish tacking down the film, the next step is to apply tack solution and heat all around the edges. Keep in mind when you are tacking down the film, you want to tack down the film at an angle. You don't want to accidentally crease the film when you are tacking it down to the edges. So just use tack solution, heat, and a microfiber towel to seal all the edges all around. So for this last piece, what you need to do is lay the film onto the tail light first, just to get an idea of how the layout will be. Once you lay the film down to the tail light, the next step is starting from the bottom, tacking the bottom down, and making your way to the top of the tail light. So when you're laying the tint to the tail light, the first pass is going to be a light pass. This is just to guide yourself in applying the tint to the edge of the tail light. So just finish off aligning the top. And then once you finish aligning the top, make sure to align the bottom piece as well. Once everything is aligned and in position where it needs to be, the next step is to use your squeegee and tack down everything. When you're tacking down, make sure you're applying more pressure. That way the film stays onto the tail light. Once we have squeegee all around the tent, the next step is to use tack solution, heat, and a microfiber towel to seal the edges of the tent. Make sure you seal all around, that way the film sticks to the tail light. And the last thing to do once you finish installing the tent, you will need to post heat all of the tent all around. That way we secure the tent and it stays to the tail light and it doesn't peel over time. So just use tack solution, heat, and your microfiber towel to go all around the edges and seal tint and once you seal all the edges you're done with the installation so that concludes the installation video for the tail light tints for the 2022 silverado 1500 custom if you guys do have any questions in regards to installation feel free to message us and we'll help you guys out thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys on the next video